Hey folks, Dread Dragon Flame here again. Uh, just uh, trying a new project here. I got uh, this old wrought iron fencing. It is, uh, I'm using it to support the ends of this uh, failed <laughs> um, greenhouse, which someday I might be able to get back together again. But this was an extra piece that was too long anyways, and I got to think that it would make a great uh, sturdy broad fork. Uh, I don't know if you've heard of them or not, but um, they're nice to use in place of a rototiller, especially in areas that have been tilled before, just for loosening the soil instead of chopping it all up, uh, chopping up the worms and stuff with a rototiller. But um, what I've done here is I've, uh, I've made a cut here already, and I started cutting the bars. I don't, can't really see it, I guess, but I started cutting the bars. There's be one, two, three, four just four tines on this one but I can actually get two pieces out of this uh, one section um, so I can either like weld them together or just clamp them together and what I'm thinking about doing is uh, attaching them to a, uh, a hand truck uh, to the, to the, uh, the lip the lifting lip or whatever on a hand truck onto the bottom of it and then maybe weight it with a cinder block or something, uh, and tie it down to the hand truck, and just like get a little forward motion going and dig these tines down into the ground, maybe at an angle, I'll mount them at an angle or something, dig the tines down into the ground, and then just keep pushing forward and just drive the, uh, the tines up through the soil to, uh, to help break it apart. Uh, I'll be showing little steps here and there along the way. Uh, right now I'm just getting the materials together. Uh, hesitant to show you my... This is actually the the other side of the house. Uh, or my chicken coop. There's a big huge mess out here, but... Oh well, this is me. Uh, and this is my goat barn. Uh, just built last year. Right now I'm using for storage until we get some goats. Well, usually it's just just the dog run and parking lot for vehicles and whatnot. There's my uh, there's the RV that I uh, just got started up and uh, confirmed that it runs. But I'll be moving that over into the garden. I'm going to incorporate that into the community garden so people got a place to wash up or use the bathroom or it's got you know kitchen in it, in it and somebody needs to take a nap or whatnot. But I'm going to cover the whole thing over and. Uh, fence it all in and whatnot so people can't really mess with it but that'll become part of a uh, part of the garden and uh here's my uh my 62 scout it's got no no electronics no semiconductors in it whatsoever but runs like a top and it's even got a uh a full tilt plow on the front that would make a nice uh bug out vehicle if i absolutely have to <laughs> All right, just I want to make this short. Keep in touch. Peace.